Good afternoon YouTube. Well I can't believe it's almost a fortnight now since the uh, the ride out in Lincoln. Uh, what a fantastic day that was. Um, some great people, great ride out, uh, rode some roads I'd not ridden before. Uh, pity the weather wasn't uh, a little bit warmer but uh, that said it was still a great day. Um, the only poor thing that happened, um, I had a uh, personal message from uh, one of the young guys that was riding a 125 the other day to say that um, he'd actually been caught speeding, which uh, has kind of taken the shine off it slightly, which is such a shame. Um, that's the problem with ride outs. If you're uh, you're stuck near the back. Uh, there is a temptation to try and uh, catch up with the guys at the front, and uh, and if you're not careful, um, ride a little bit too quick. And uh, I certainly know those roads in Lincolnshire are notoriously bad uh, for uh, police cameras. And we uh, we did pass one, so it must have been that one that he got caught with. I must admit, when uh, when I saw it, I had a bit of a a brown, brown trouser moment and I had to check uh, what speed I was doing so a uh, bit of tough luck that really so uh, I know when I spoke to him about it um, he seemed quite upbeat about it really and uh, seems to think that uh, he'll get away with a uh, speed awareness course so uh, just something to sort of bear in mind guys isn't it when you're on a ride out not to uh, not to travel too fast, but when you're in a in a large or well, a fairly large group and you're trying to catch up, you know. But uh, you know, let's face it, we all we all do it. I'm no exception, you know. Uh, it is very tempting sometimes when you see a nice bit of nice bit of road just to uh, open up the throttle and uh, give it some. But at the same time, you do have to be careful and uh, keep your eyes peeled for those that. Uh, try and spoil your fun slightly so uh, hopefully it's not put him off and uh, we'll see him again on uh, many other ride outs uh, the other thing I wanted to talk about was uh, online storage um, I don't know if anyone's got any uh, experience of online storage but uh, I've currently got one of these um, portable hard drives and it's uh, it's almost maxed out um, I forget how big it is but I've certainly used all but a few megabytes of uh, the available memory on it and I'm uh, I'm undecided as to whether to uh, buy another one or uh, go for the online version the online option um, I know that uh, PC World do a number which you can either pay a yearly fee or a a five yearly fee and I just wondered whether anybody's got some experience and, uh, and uh, whether you can give me a bit of advice on it. I can certainly see the uh, the positives from doing it that way uh, because I think some of the uh, things you can do is you can access your files from uh, anywhere so if you've got a phone or a tablet or a laptop you can uh, access those phone, uh, those files anywhere you like. Whereby, uh, if you've got your uh, portable storage device, you're kind of limited to uh, plugging it in to uh, whatever you're using, whether it's a, a laptop or a a PC. So, uh, just a little bit undecided at the moment what to do. So, uh, perhaps you guys can uh, give me some advice, especially those that are a bit more techy minded than I am and uh, let me know what you think. I can't actually think of anything else at the moment uh, other than uh, a bit of quite poorly of late. Um, in fact I was I was ill the day before the uh, Lincolnshire ride out and I've not been well since. Um, I think I've had a touch of man flu which uh, I'm hopefully getting over. I've just finished the uh, my course of antibiotics today, so I'm going to give it a day or two if it still hasn't uh, 
cleared up. I think I'm going to have to go back to the quacks for uh, another course. I think I've had uh, some sort of chest infection. I seem to have this cough that I can't seem to uh, shake and uh, sometimes it's it's that bad it's actually making me physically sick which is uh, which is not good. Right, I think that'll do for now. So uh, as always guys, ride safe and uh, I'll catch you next time.